Hello everyone, Namaste. Hope you all are doing well. In this video, we are going to learn how to illustrate a responsive logo for a drone video production company in Adobe Illustrator. As per an article on 99designs.com, responsive logos are shape shifting logos that change in size, complexity, or sometimes even in color to fit and adapt to wherever they are placed. Walt Disney is the perfect example of a great responsive logo. As we can see, how the logo is shape shifted so that it can look fantastic across various sizes. If you are new to this channel please consider subscribing and also hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any of my future updates so let's get started open adobe illustrator and create a new document of 2000 by 2000 pixels set the color mode to rgb raster effects to 150 ppi and click create now let's drag the reference sketch onto the canvas Click on the square of the current layer and check the template box. It will dim down the image so that we can illustrate easily. Also I am going to unlock the layer and rotate the reference image to 45 degrees so it becomes easy for us to take accurate proportions. Now create a new layer and name it as outline. We are going to illustrate our logo in this layer. Start by drawing a circle in the center for the drone camera. Later we are going to add 4 smaller circles using the rotate tool to complete the drone body. If you don't know how to use the rotate tool yet, you can learn it from my previous video. Use the outline mode by pressing Ctrl plus Y for more clarity of the paths. Now merge the shapes with the shape builder tool and convert the edges to curves by using the selection tool. Fill the created shape with black color and set the stroke to zero. Now use the ellipse tool to draw the propeller and set the stroke to black and the color fill to blank. While drawing the inner circle, set the cap to round cap from the stroke main. Select both of the circles and pick the rotate tool. Hold Alt key and click on the center of the drone body. As we want 4 propellers in total, so set the rotation degree to 90 degrees and click copy. Now keep pressing Ctrl plus D till you get 3 propellers and add details to the drone camera by using the ellipse tool. Select all of the shapes and set the rotation back to minus 45 degrees. Go to object and click expand. 
then go to pathfinder tool and click merge Let's color the logo. I am going to set the primary color to dark grey and secondary color to dark red. You can use any other colors you want. Remove the unwanted shapes by the direct selection tool and delete. Now select the logo and select free distort from the free transform tool. I'm going to transform the logo a little bit to add some perspective. Add some background and text for the finishing touch and we are done. Good job. Now you can save this logo in any of the image formats such as JPG, PNG etc. Give it a thumbs up if you like the video, share it with your friends and don't hesitate to ask any queries in the comment box. The Behance project link is given in the description below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.